What is up you guys? It is Jessica doing things differently and today we have a Shein haul. So all of this stuff was super cheap so I can't say no. Yeah, <laughs> I just can't no matter no matter how much I try I can't. Before we go ahead and get started into today's video let's go ahead and do the shout out of the week and today's shout out goes to YouTube Beauty Stars 2011. Thank you so much for the comment. You know, sometimes it just takes that one person to really just boost you up. You know, that one comment that's just so sweet, you just can't look past it. And that was that comment right there. It just made me feel good for the entire day. And I appreciate that. So thank you so much for commenting. Think before you say something negative to somebody. And when you're going to give somebody a compliment or think that you want to give it to them, just do it. It can't hurt. <laughs> All right, you guys, without further ado, let's go ahead and get into today's video. Let's go. Okay, so to start with, I got this. What is it? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. It's eight piece stackable measuring cups and spoon set. This was a dollar sixty-eight. It's now a dollar sixty-seven. However, when I did click on it, it did say that it was sold out. However, it brought more uh, sellers up. So I do you know you can find this other places. My cat just got up there and just is he's right there. Literally, he's about to walk in front of the camera. Boodoo, you can't be up here, baby. Him Tempe up here. Him Tempe up here. You want to say hello? You want to say hello? No, he doesn't. Back to this. I got it in the color teal, and not because it matched my kitchen, because honestly, it doesn't really. Um, I got it in the color teal because that was the only color available that was that low of a price. And sometimes I'm just like, I don't even care. Because who cares if your measuring cups match your kitchen if they're going to be in a drawer? You know what I mean? I'm not that particular. It's going to be in a drawer. Who cares, right? So here are all the measuring cups stacked nice. And then we have all the spoons. And honestly, these little guys are the reason I got this because I do have these, but I can't read what size the spoons are anymore because it wore off. Um, and because this is engraved, hopefully that won't happen. And then the same on these as well. They are engraved on the handle, which is really, really nice. Really, really can't beat that at all. Next, we have a pack of four different blushes. So this was $1.90. It's now $3.20, which honestly still isn't bad for four of them. Does anybody else have a hard time like getting them out of these little boxes? I just can't stand it. Oh, and it comes with a little... Why would you need this for blush? That seems weird. Okay, well, we're just going to swatch each of them. They really are all very similar in color, but here they are. Okay. So, so here they are. These ones are the two darker ones. These are the lighter ones. It's definitely showing up on camera a little bit different color than they actually are in real life. But let me go ahead and swatch these for you so you can see them. But each one of them came with one of these, which I will use for like my eyeshadow maybe, but I definitely won't be using it for my blush. Um, I don't even know how you could really use that for blush because you have to cover like a bigger area. So I don't know. I guess I'm happy that they gave it with these because I can swatch them, I suppose. Here is this color. You can't really see it too, too much, but it is a kind of like a really, really um, light pink. This one right here is this color here. So here is that one. I actually don't mind that one for real. The last one, which in my opinion is more like a coral color, very similar to the last one we just looked at, but definitely not as dark. That is this one. So yeah, I got four blushes for a little over a dollar and that's pretty good. Next we have um, a, I think it's a three piece set. So it was $1.61, now it's $1.60. And I like to have different jewelry all the time, just options, you know what I mean? I like to have options. And I don't necessarily want them to be real, you know what I mean? I want them to be kind of like costume jewelry because um, I know that I wear so many and I, I like to have so many different varieties 
that if they were real, <laughs> I'd be broke. So, uh, costume jewelry is fine for me, especially with the price. Oh my God, I'm struggling. <laughs> I need this on. I need another hand. I can't get this on. But basically, it's a bracelet, and this goes through here somehow. Yeah, just like that. And then there's a little dangly piece here. So that's how it is. There's the bracelet. And then we have a ring. Oh, this might be a bigger, uh, maybe like a four piece set or something. And here is the ring. It has a little dangly bit there. It'll actually probably fit every finger like every bigger finger, it's not gonna fit my ring finger by any means because it's still a little bit bigger, but I like that. And then we have earrings. Look at this. Ooh, and I really like these. They're just like regular little chains. And they are the open, where you open it up like that and then you close it. I like these because you don't have to worry about messing around with the backs or anything like that or losing backs. And then in here, then I'm assuming this is going to be the necklace part of it. So it is three in one where they're all connected. And we have like the bigger chain, we have the little V, and we have that that's kind of connected with the other pieces to connect all the pieces together. So this is definitely a four piece set. Five if you include both sets of earrings, which I don't because it's a pair of earrings, so you only count it as one, you know? He has mammy a sec, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? This right here, I couldn't find this anywhere in my order. I don't know if it's something that they just threw in for free. If so, that was really, really nice of them. If I did buy this and I just couldn't find it in my order, that's cool too. <laughs> but um, it doesn't necessarily look like something I would order, but if it was cheap enough, probably, you know? But it is a double, um, Kind of looks like a flower, four leaf clover type deal, but oh wait, look at that. I actually really like that. I think that's really, really nice. Yes, but I don't know what size that is or anything because I don't know if I really ordered that or if it was a gift. Again, if it was a gift, thank you. <laughs> if I bought it, thank myself. Yes, my wrist star. Moving on. We have a four piece, or I'm sorry, a three piece cutting tool. Now, I already have something like this on my keychain, and when I tell you it comes in handy all the time, I can't express that enough. I use it to cut boxes, cut open packages, cut little strings, cut open envelopes, um, whatever I can think, like and t at times where I'm like, I can't find scissors, I'll use that. I'll always gravitate towards that. So this was 80 cents, it's now 81 cents. And they're basically just little cutting tools that you can put on your keychain or really you just have them in a drawer or whatever you want. But these ones happen to be shaped in a cloud. And you just push this over and the blade comes out and then you can do your cutting. But I love these things. They literally come in handy so often. So I had to get more because the ones that I have on my keychain now are dull. They're just not working the same anymore, so I got new ones. You know, gotta replace the old out with the old and with the new. And I'm really sorry, I can't stop saying that. And there's this person who comments, uh, Tammy, I believe, and she's always saying how she has now started saying that. If you are somebody who started saying that as well, please leave a comment down below because I just think that is so cool. Um, I love that. <laughs> it's just like a way for me to like, when I'm excited, I'm like, oh, this video would be really cool. If you guys have started saying that as well, let me know, because I'd like to know, you know? You know? <laughs> All right, next we have this little piece right here. So this is for your um, uh, laundry soap. And when you don't have, okay, how do I explain it? So basically it's a shelf for your lid to sit on so that you can pour out the liquid. Right? Makes sense. And you don't have to like hold the cup right there. Yes, it's lazy. I get it. I know. But it was, okay. <laughs> it was probably more than it was worth, but it was $1.33. It's now $1.08. Um, but I saw it and I was like, why not? You know, why not? It's one of those things. And 
like I said, just pretty straightforward. You put this around the little um, the spout, and then you put your lid here, and then you just and do it. Uh, I don't know why I needed it, for real, for real. I probably didn't, but I got it because I don't know why. <laughs> I don't know. I thought it was cool. So there's that. Um, next, we have two sets of pens. Now, I got three, six, nine, twelve, twelve pens here, and then six pens here. So, this pack of twelve was $1.51, and now it's $1.59, and these are gel pens. So, they're going to write smoother, they're going to write nicer, and a lot of times, I will do a lot of, like, doodling artwork where it, it doesn't make sense. It's just me doodling on paper, and then I'll color it in sometimes. Sometimes, I'll just leave it black and white, but... All my pens have run out, so I need new ones. And I know that these pens are good because I've used them before. But they are like a matte black, and then they just have the little handle here, obviously. And then it's also comfortable to hold, very lightweight. Then I got another pack of pens that I've never tried before, and I was like, maybe these will work better. I don't know. I'm going to get them. But I got these because they were only 78 cents. And again, I was like, why not? Um, but now they're $1.59. So not only are they aesthetically pleasing, they're also supposed to be gel pens as well, and they're supposed to write really well. So there are six of them. They're pretty cute. That one has like a little heartbreak on it. I mean, do they have all the same? No, that one has like a little cloud on it. This one has like a little leaf. This one has a rainbow. This one has music notes, and this one has a three-leaf clover. So again, they're aesthetically pleasing. It has like a very thin tip. So again, hopefully they work well. Really, that's all that I care about. Next, we have a watch. So this was $1.62, now it's $2.08. And I believe a bracelet comes with this as well. If I'm being honest, I thought the way that this watch looked was very, I don't know, I really liked the design. I thought it was really cool. Um, and I would wear it, uh, like if I dressed up or something, you know what I mean? Because I thought it was like nice on the eye. I didn't really buy it for the function of having a watch, but here it is. So isn't that just cool? It just looks cool to me, anyways. So it's, this is glass, but it looks like there's nothing there. It kind of looks like it's hollow. And then the band is white and there is, it looks cool. And it came with a bracelet. So let's take a look at the bracelet. Bracelet's like real dainty. And again, I like jewelry. I just do. Uh, I'm a big fan of accessorizing. I accessorize even if I'm in a hoodie. You know what I mean? Like I accessorize everything I wear. It's just who I am. The bracelet is a cute little white heart and it will go well with the watch. See? Here's my real shirt. So winner, winner, chicken dinner. <laughs> you okay? Winner, winner, chicken dinner. All right. Next, I got this. This was um, $1.78. Now it's $1.96. And I kind of got this to try it because if it does work, then I'm going to get another one. But this is one of those things where you take your animal's paw and it's like an ink pad and then you put it on the little card sock that they give you. You can pick what color you you want in with these, but I did, there, there has two in here. So technically I can use this twice and do it um, for Voodoo and Pumpkin, our kitties. And then put these in a frame with their picture or something like that, you know what I mean? get a little crafty with it. So you basically just put their little paw in there. You can do dogs, cats, hamsters, whatever animal you got. You could probably do for all if they'll let you do it. Um, but I just thought this was cool, you know? I had never seen it before. And when I saw it, it kind of was like, yeah, I want that. I want to try that. See, if and you can also probably do like baby feet because they're really small. So I could get one for my grandson. Um, so if they work, great. If not, it wasn't that much. You know, it's trial and error. Trial and error. Next, we have these two books. 
Again, I have my little pens now. I can use this book to like doodle in. And I doodle a lot when my brain is just going. You know what I mean? Like it's going at 100 miles per hour and I can't stop it. I just sit down and I start doodling. And it does help. It, it calms everything down. and kind of just allows me to take a beat. So you know what I mean? I do think that I have ADHD. I've never been officially diagnosed, but I definitely think that I do because a lot of times I just can't shut my brain down. But this, these book loops were $247. They're now $680, so a bit of a jump. But you got two of them for $247, and I think that's a decent deal. They had a lot of positive reviews as well, but they're just like little matte booklets. And then you open them up, and they're just blank white pages. So... It's a pretty nice size booklet for, you know, to get two of them, just to doodle in, just to draw in. Nice size pages, big enough for me to doodle and not like feel overwhelmed by the picture that I am doing. Because a lot of times I'll doodle on like a regular copy paper. And because the paper is so big, I'm like, I'm never going to finish this. And then I start to think about that. And then my brain can't shut off about that. So smaller pages, doodle away. Hopefully it'll make me happy. But there's that. All right. Next, we have these guys. This is cake um, tips and bags. So it's a 20 piece, 26 piece set. It was $1.48, now it's $1.77. And I did a cake or cupcakes for my um, my daughter's daughter's birthday party, her first birthday party. And when I was doing the cake or the cupcakes, I was thinking like, wouldn't it be nice if I had like some cake decorating tips? I could make this look so much better. Here's a picture of what it looked like. They didn't look bad. They actually look pretty good. But I took a, um, a freezer bag and I cut the tip off, put all the frosting in, then cut the tip off, and I did it like that. I kind of used it as like a dotting tool, but frosting in it. Um, and I was like, nah, nah, not doing that again. So here is the bag that came. And then you just put these tips on. And then here are the little, um, so you put this tip around the bag and then you put this around it and then twist this down to tighten it. But it comes with a bunch of different um, tips. So a lot of really good tips. I mean, the 26 tips, you can't, I mean, you can't go wrong. <laughs> you just can't go wrong. That'll make my, my life and time a lot easier. So. All right, next we have another necklace. This was 92 cents. It is now 91 cents. So we have two here. We have the pearls and then just the dainty chain. And then we have this one, which is just a dainty chain with a cross on it. But if you put them all together, this is how it looked online. Just cute, simple, but enough to make a statement if you're wanting to make one. But also enough to add this to something that's very... You know, when you're not really trying to do too much, this just gives enough, you know? Next, we have these. So these were $3.02. They're now $3 even. And these are the facial patches, frownies. I don't know if they're actually frownies, but I've gotten frownies before, and they came in a box that looked just like this. But this is for your forehead, your uh, mouth creases, like your wrinkles right around here under eyes right here, wherever you're starting to get wrinkles in your neck, wherever. And you put these on before bed, you wash your face, make sure that there's no makeup on, and then you put them on your face to go to bed in, you wake up, you pull them off. It says uh, eight to 16 weeks supply of patch to paper with water activated adhesive. And again, you just put them on, go to bed, forget about it, wake up, you get better. <laughs> okay, so. Here they are. And then you just put a little bit of water on your face and then you stick these on by pulling your face taut. And the water has an act, like the water activates the adhesive on here. And again, you just put it on and forget about it. So I am going to start wearing these and I'm going to kind of show you guys my fine lines before I started wearing them. And then six to eight weeks after I've been wearing them, and kind of show you guys if there was any results, if it worked well, whatever. Um, unfortunately, yes, I know six to 18 weeks. Was it six to 18? No, eight to 16, dyslexic ass. <laughs> uh, um, I know that's a long time to have a product review, but that is the recommended amount of time. I'll come back in eight weeks, kind of tell you guys what's going on, and then I'll come back in the 16 weeks, kind of let you guys know what happened. So hopefully they work because 
I am starting to notice as I get older right here and right here, I'm starting to get like cr and like more creasing, you know? And I don't like that. I mean, we're all going to get older. You know what I mean? I can't, I can't beat age. But if I can like prevent it from happening so quickly, we're going to try it. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Yes, ma'am. Yes, sir. Okay. And the last product is these liners for the air fryer. So these were a dollar fifty-eight. They're now two oh six, and we got a hundred of these. And they're just little squares that you throw in there, and then you get rid of them when you're done. Pretty self-explanatory. But that concludes today's haul. I hope you guys enjoyed this haul. If you did, make sure please give it a big thumbs up. If you guys can comment down below, a one-word comment, a sentence or a paragraph. I don't care what you comment. Just comment down below because that will help circulate my videos across YouTube. And that would, I would greatly appreciate that. Uh, if you do comment, I might shout you out in one of my upcoming videos. And as always, please make sure that you subscribe and press that notification for every time I upload another video, you guys will be updated. And as always, please go ahead and share this video with a friend, a coworker, aunt, uncle, grandma, grandpa, I don't care who you share them with, just share it. All right, you guys, and until next time, I will see you guys later. Also, make sure you tell me what you want me to do. What kind of hauls do you guys want to see? Just let me know. What do you want to see? What site? What do you want to see from that site? Kind of give me some ideas because um, I can get drunk all day long. I can you know, just get random shit all day long. I, I know how to do that. But if there's something specific that you guys would like to see, please let me know. All right, you guys, until next time. Bye.